Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's win this thing! <laughs> thank you, thank you, that means a lot coming from you, Pink. Alright, Blue Moon Dunes Championship. This could very well be the last in the game, for all we know. I don't know, but we'll see. Well, we've played the first six holes, I believe, with it, but we haven't seen the rest of them. Can I, like, check the tournament standings? Uh, no? No? Well, okay. <laughs> I guess we'll see the tournament standings after our first hole, then. That will be just fine, I suppose. <laughs> Alright, as long as it goes and rolls out to the fairway, we should... I was gonna say, we should be able to make the green in two-ish, but, well... But, well, that's not looking good. <laughs> well, that's okay. As long as we do some pars, get some birdies, we should be okay overall. Oh, jeez, this is not a good start. I was expecting to roll, it out, roll out that much, but eh, 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 eh. We can do this. We can do this. The only limits are between our own ears in golf. Just believe in ourselves and we can win this! Hopefully. <laughs> Maybe this will be the one tournament that will... Oh, there's slope on here now. Interesting. But yeah, maybe this will be the one tournament that I'll need to do a couple tries at. Who knows? Anyway, a nice safe par to start out with. That one's gonna be a hard one to get, a, get birdie badges on in the future. Alright, so let's see here. Let's see the tournament standings. Hmm. Um. Excuse me? Everyone else is over par? No! Oh, Jay Witz is playing it? No, that's not Jay Witz. Oh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, uh, everyone is over. Is Doug his son? I, thi I think so. Anyway, everyone else. He's Driver. <laughs> well, Flagnet. <laughs> But yeah, um, if everyone's gonna shoot over par, I don't think I'm gonna have that much trouble with this, but we'll see. I mean, they did say that the course was gonna eat me alive, supposedly, so maybe it's eating them alive instead, because I have much, much better course management? I don't know. Anyway, I'm in the fairway. You notice that I'm still using the nice use the rough to slow down the ball technique so I can get my ball to stop where I'd like it, at least in most cases. <laughs> mistakes happen in judgment, but that's okay. As long as we get our birdies and we get our pars, we'll probably win this thing. Uh, ooh, uh, oh. I, I really like my, my super lofted wedge for this. I guess I'll have to deal with the 9-iron and potentially use the tree. It's my advantage. Let's find out. Oh, that might be overhit. Yeah, that was overhit. Yeah, my own fault on my timing. Alas, alas. But, what if I putt this? Can I putt this? I would bet I can putt this. <laughs> Probably can putt this. Let's try putting it. Go all the way over there for all that rough. Yes, nailed it. <laughs> Woo, it's kind of kind of tricky to feel that out because of the whole um because I had the tree in my way. Plus I had all that rough. I should say the tree in my line to feel things out. So yeah, eh, it turned out fine though. We are okay. Let's see what we got here. Nope, they're uh, dropping shots. I'm gaining shots. <laughs> Well, I, sh I should say I, I'm. They're 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 the ones that are gaining sh shots because you know they're taking higher scores than I am. But you know, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna aim this way this time. I think the other. I, I think the other time I aimed off to the left, but this time I'm gonna go off to the right. I think. I think this was the one that I went to. Just just for a little variety. I think. Wait, what? Oh yeah, this is a very long hole. <laughs> Uh, oh, I could use the turtle. Sure, let's try the turtle. Why not? <laughs> if there's a turtle, it is meant to be utilized. Holy poopers! <laughs> that thing really flew. <laughs> well, 
That might make getting a birdie a little bit more difficult, being in the rough, but we'll see. Uh, I just want to be on the green, so I'm going to try and use the 11-yard range and average it out in my estimation. Okay. That should be alright. I think I just aim a smidge over to the right for that slope. And probably a good amount of power. Ooh, ah! Heck yeah! Woo! Scores. Oh no! Uh oh, uh oh! Doug's coming back! Is that even par? That could be the end of me! No, I'm still too up. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is the one that I utilized the turtle. Uh, oh no, I can't utilize the turtle this time. <laughs> I think on the tournament, the tees are uh, a lot more like further back. Let's go all the way back and... Yeah, I think they're putting me all the way back over here instead of the other ones when I was in the match play. Which was allowed me to actually reach the turtle, but that's okay. We can still pull off a birdie on this. As I said, there are no limitations except for between your ears, and I overhit that. <laughs> uh, no, maybe I didn't overhit that. I mean, it, it did. It, it was a little dicey coming to the the edge of the fairway like that, but it still worked out fine. The results are the only things that matter in golf and having fun. <laughs> uh, let's see here. That should be about right. I hope. <laughs> Trying that crisscross of the slope with the wind there. Uh, that, was a, that was pretty close, I would say. The, the late didn't like the slope didn't take it as much down as I thought it was going to, but I will accept that as a nice shot anyway, because that still yielded a birdie for me. Uh, scores still at even, and he's almost done too. And like the next hole is the only one that he'll be able to get a birdie on, because this is another nine holer. So, the best he's gonna get probably is one under. Although, I guess he could hit, hit it in from a distance as Eagle, assuming that uh, it's reachable. I don't <laughs> we'll see, I guess. Uh, should I utilize the fast fairway? Should I? Yes, I did notice that it was indeed fast fairway on the, the, the bottom right corner of the. Oh no! That's everybody doing! <laughs> I didn't know that was there. <laughs> Should have paid more attention to the flyover. But yeah, I did notice that it, that was fast fairway, at least in certain places. Uh, like at, at different colors, but that's okay. That's okay, we can still par this anyway, I think. <laughs> Boink. Just use the rough. Use the rough, Luke. Oh, shoot. That did not land in the rough. Oh, poopers. And that is a really long part four, too, by the way. I think that's why they have the, the fast fairway there. Okay, so I'm going for the chipping, of course. Ooh, that's why I'm hitting with the low lofted shot. So close. So close. That's going to be a bogey. Oh, my own fault for not paying enough attention on the flyover. Alas. Alas. Oh, we're still two up. Doesn't make much. Doesn't make that big of a difference. All right, new whole territory. I think. No, wait. This isn't. No, not not yet. Wait. No, no. I didn't think it is. Yeah, because I we were five up. I mean, a uh, four up through. No, wait. No, no. No, no. Wait. Did, did we play this one when I was in the match? Hmm. Hmm, maybe I just don't recognize the landing area because I'm playing the back tees right now. Yeah, baby! Utilizing that rough like a pro. Uh, ooh. I have another in-between club scenario here. Uh, that actually should be fine right about there. Oh, I overhit it again! Dang it! What is with me and overhitting today? I don't know. Well, maybe that wasn't an overhit. I just figured with the, the medium slope. That would have uh, caused me ire, but yeah, that, uh, we, yeah, we did play this one before, it was, it was, it was at 290 yard par 3, <laughs> but it's 352 yards here. I don't think there's any par 3 of that length in the world. <laughs> I could be wrong about that though, like maybe they're the ones that they play in those high atmosphere, I mean a uh, high altitude, excuse me, 
ones where, you know, you get the extra long ball flight because of the, th the thinner air. Maybe, but uh, there's not a lot of courses like that. <laughs> I've just never heard of a course with that long of... Like, look at this! Look at this, the, this par 4 is shorter than that par 3! <laughs> So I, I, I'm, I'm calling BS on that being a par three. But I, 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 I would call that a birdie in the score that I got there. <laughs> just, just to be frank with you there. Oh, <laughs> well, it should be okay. I'm, I'm much closer to the green than I was before. Although I, I got it's, oh, it's lodged, not just buried. So that actually could be a water ball, unless I purposefully go long, like just to play it safe, which I probably should do. So I'm just gonna do that. If it goes in the rough, it goes in the rough. If it if it ends up short, it'll be on the green probably. Uh, yeah, that was about how I'd expect it to play out. That's okay. All is well. Now I don't wanna putt into the water at this point here, so this might be a deadly putt. But we'll see. <laughs> yeah, that's that. It, it rim the hole. It's like it accelerated after it rimmed the hole. <laughs> ah, we should be fine. Bunk. Yeah, bogey well. Bogey well. We're still okay. We are still in the lead. This is definitely a hard course because of its length. I, I guess and. Well, I keep flowing on certain things, but that's my own fault and not... It, that, it's, it's not all the course's difficulty is what I'm saying here. Um, why, is it, why is it always showing the slope, no matter what on this course? It's kind of kind of weird. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to hit through the tree, I think. Just let it roll out to that uh, long portion of fairway there. At least I think it's going to... Oh, it didn't hit through the tree, but... Uh, oh, really? <laughs> Just a couple pixels more. Well, that's a par 4 anyway. Uh, as long as I'm paring the last two holes, we are good. But you know me. I'm always going for the scoring. As, as boring as my round is, it, it, because I'm always super strategic, I am yet still trying to score as best I can, so I guess it's technically not boring in that a in that aspect. <laughs> I've just been calling my rounds boring because of Lucky's round ever since. Lucky, he plays like no one has played before. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There's our birdie. I wonder how that last hole is going to be though, because it's another par 6. It's, it's probably gonna be like a thousand yards or something like that. Just to be like the grand finale of all holes. Uh-oh. I was gonna say, we're we going into a cutscene for this final hole? Holy moly! And I didn't even see the whole left side of the hole, because it just went straight to it. 832 yards. That's not impossibly long or anything like that. It's definitely a three-shotter, but what I mean is that... I don't think even with my distance currently at what it's set, I'm gonna have difficulties getting into birdie range on the hole, so, yep. Alright, nice little bit of backspin to control the rollout. That was, I mean, it did it roll out more than I wanted it to because it landed on the fairway, but it just puts me all the way aim into the ocean or whatever because, because that's directly where the pin is. We've gotta, we gotta take the long route, I think. Uh, utilize the wind to avoid the water and use the rough to halt my rollout. Oh, wait, what? Why didn't the wind take it more to the left? That is kind of weird. But anyway, uh, ooh. should I be playing to the island or should I continue down this route? This is actually a much dicier hole than I was expecting. <laughs> Uh, let's see what I can do here. Oh, I think the three iron is actually hitting me over the trees. That's why I'm getting more distance with that. Yeah! That's why I'm getting more distance with that than the woods. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna... I probably want to go over to that island because it's more of a direct route to the hole. Rather than taking the long way around, maybe. Might be... Don't go in the water! Don't, don't, no, no, no! What? Did that... No! How is that a bunker? 
It's a, it's a bank. <laughs> uh, where's the, where's the green now? I don't know. Uh, I guess I'll, I just might have to pop it out over here. I guess, I guess maybe, might be. Eh, eh. Yeah, that should be fine. <laughs> It's a three-yard range, not a fifteen-yard range. <laughs> okay, so now I'm, I'm now I'm assuming I should be able to make the green. Yeah. Okay. All right. So I still kind of flub this hole, but I don't think I'm gonna flub it enough that I'm not gonna win the tournament. <laughs> Let's be honest here. Go, driver. Go and land. Land and be free. Yeah, I got two shots to win now. <laughs> um, a lot of slope. We're at medium here. Mm, nope. Mm, oh. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Actually, I got. It's come to think that I think I have more more than two shots to win here. But anyway, details. Hmm. Hmm. All right. So hit at a decent amount of power there. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> what, if, what happens if I tie, actually, come to think of it? I never really thought about that. It might just be like an auto win, like in uh, Mario Golf. <laughs> yeah, that was that was not well played on my part. <laughs> At an even par, so yeah, we, we tied. But that was my own fault on that. <laughs> Let's see what happens. I don't know. Huh? Is that a silver trophy or a gold trophy? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not not too sure about that. Uh, okay, that was a gold trophy, or <laughs> maybe it's a platinum trophy. I cannot believe what we have witnessed today, Mike. Yes, Tucker, we thought it impossible. Yet here we are. I didn't. I didn't technically win that, did I? <laughs> if this was actual uh, pro tour golf, he would go into match play then. But well, but well. an amateur has stolen the championship. What do you mean, amateur? And there isn't a single person here who isn't gov smacked by the fact. Certainly is. I don't believe anybody was even watching his round. <laughs> Maybe he cheated. Are you sure there wasn't any, was even a scorekeeper? <laughs> Just as I said. Around to make sure you didn't cheat. I'll make sure to ask him in my exclusive interview. You're never going to interview me, are you? Right, Mike. But first, my interview. Sir, just over a week ago, you were swinging a club on the range for the first time. Oh, and yes, he is indeed a named dog then, I guess. Now you've taken the game's highest honor. How do you make sense of this? Well, Tucker, I put down the golf clubs because I didn't think I had it in me. At least, that's what I told myself. But, maybe, I was just afraid of winning. Oh, you are so full of it! <laughs> <laughs> You're only saying that now because you won. I kind of tied. <laughs> I'm going to replay the course anyway until I get under par, so... Yeah. You're right. I don't know why I said that. What I really mean is, the course was lovely today. Got some berries when I needed them, and par is a good score here. Well, I, t I did par, but... I don't know. I always like to shoot under par. What? Sorry, I'm a little flustered. <laughs> I didn't really prepare for this. <laughs> Laura, what's your takeaway? The same as everybody else's. Golf really is the best sport. And I don't think anybody here would dispute that. Certainly not. I I could make a strong argument for cricket, but I won't. <laughs> Speaking of which, as all we have time today, because the championship ran long. And, as luck would have it, the cricket is on next, so he can't spare an extra, extra second. Dang it! <laughs> wait, wait, wait! I just like to say, no, interview over. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, our stories don't end here. That's what I thought. I didn't think the game would end after that. Come on now. <laughs> oh no! This is the best grounds crew I've ever had. <laughs> the moles are better than the humans. Secondhand ball sales are through the roof. Happy to help. <laughs> hmm. Have you noticed any golfing prodigies among the roll mole rats? Hmm. Hmm. Anyone? Oh man, they got a lot of minions now. Any one of those moles could be the next champion. The holes are all par one. You can do them at your leisure in any order. Well, best of luck with those holes. Will you stop bugging me about it? I said we're not interested. <laughs> this just bugs everyone about getting the hole in ones on the his course. We don't like golf. It's rule people and boring people. <laughs> 
<laughs> Maybe we should just do it so he stops asking. <laughs> Maybe we'll like it. Are you being serious right now? I don't know if we can be friends anymore. Wait, I thought they were running the course after... So I guess they were just running the course <laughs> reluctantly. But in reality, they were just building their minions to try and take over the world! I was just kidding. <laughs> Golf is the worst! <laughs> oh, I see. Come on, let's go lay claim the tidy park. Minions, let's go! <laughs> The simulator, let's see how the swings are red this time around. Terrible. That won't do it all. You aren't shifting your weight to your front foot on your follow through. I bet simulator guy will be like, that was the best shot I've ever seen. Watch me. I thought he was gonna hit simulator guy. <laughs> hmm? You're flying them a bit high, coach. You could really maximize your distance by hitting a little higher on the ball. Watch me. Is, is the guy dead? Okay. You all hit massive slices. <laughs> that felt pretty straight. And I normally hit a draw. <laughs> the Heinrich is never wrong, Yvonne. <laughs> I disagree. I know. We're getting back on the disagreement train, aren't we? Aren't we? Hmm. You're telling me that people will be able to see Max Yards on their phones? He's, we're gonna stream them live. We're gonna be rich, rich. <laughs> yeah, dude. Sure. Tell me us. What he means to say is, uh, this is truly revolutionary technology. It will take Max's brand to the next level. We're gonna. It's it's called a webcam. There's sure to be a good golf boom in the coming years. It's just waiting for a hero to come along. Let's just make sure we emphasize the importance of distance. You lost, man. You lost. Far too many people are looking past it these days. Because I won without distance, I guess. <laughs> that part of three though, was 350 some yards, that was ridiculous. A 90 degree golf <laughs> The story continues of oh, the 90 degree wedge. That sounds incredibly rare. Only one in the world, and it doesn't work that well. I, and I'll give it to you too. <gasps> he is gonna be peeing his panties. Just need you to do a job for me. Uh oh. You want me to kill someone? But wouldn't a 90 degree club? Nah, she's a good club. You may be overthinking it a wee bit. Yes, I suppose you're right. Will it go straight up in the air? <laughs> hey, uh, do you know how to make a well worn grove trophy? <laughs> You couldn't get it for me, so I'll have one made. Eh. Yeah, I don't think you can make something like that. And even if you made it, it wouldn't have the same meaning as it being one. Ooh! Pink is getting even better than ever. Got it! Cut Swallow! You got away with it, but 9 out of 10 times that will get you in trouble. I want you to hit another one, but aim for the bunker this time. <laughs> It'll make an easy bogey from there. <laughs> I want pars and birdies, dang it! Hold on, I've already hit 10 shots. The group behind is getting mad. <laughs> no, no, on Tidy Park. Remember, you can take as long as you please, and rounds can take six hours. <laughs> no, 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 there's no need to rush. Oh! Ah! <laughs> oh, jeez, they're still here. Hurry up, we ain't got all day over here. Do we really have to play with these guys? Coach says they're the gatekeepers, the international tour. <laughs> we need to get in there, good books. Hmm. Well. Well. <laughs> if Coach says so, I guess. <laughs> Although Coach has been wrong before. <laughs> and I guess this is a full tour of all the characters and all the areas of the game. Woo! We certainly have met a lot of people along the way through the Gulf Story tournaments and journeys and matches and stuff and melted people out of ice. <laughs> still a little, still a little wondering if I'm uh, if I missed that. I should probably look that up. You know that one side quest that I think that I uh, uh, lost out on, maybe. But I, 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 I really probably should look that up, even though the idea is blind and all. Just for the sake of, maybe I should start another save file on the side and work my way back up to that spot. And those roofs were flashing in in 
in like vertical lines scrolling horizontally or something. No, I know that was the texture, how it renders st stuff. <laughs> hmm? Uh oh, the drone! A game by Sidebar Game! Oh, is this the credits? Oh! Oh, then that means I must say that I did not make the game. These awesome people did. I just made the walkthrough to help and entertain people. So, yeah. How, I wonder I wonder if I can move around or do stuff on here. I'm not sure. I'm, gonna, I'm, pr I'm pressing buttons, basically. Uh, no. All buttons are ineffective. <laughs> we can only wait it out. While we watch the drones fly by in relaxing fashion. And we can also potentially see another golf illustration later on. Because remember, remember, we still have golf to play. And it's probably going to be ugly. You're welcome. You're welcome. Was that all the credits, really? No way. That few made the game? Really? They did a great job. <laughs> I gotta say. <laughs> okay, we're in the post game, I, I think. I don't <laughs> I guess. I guess. So, with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when we see what's going on in the post game. I'll probably just end up wandering around aimlessly.